What is up you guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. I hope everyone is having a pretty good day. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. As I can see, we got a pretty big box right there. You guys might be wondering, what do I have inside of that big box? Basically, like you guys know, my vending machine business consists of only soda machines, snack machines, and a few combo machines. But I know that some people that watch my videos that want to get into vending, not everyone has the time or maybe even the money to start with a bigger machine. And basically, I want to be able to make videos for those of you that want to start with a gumball machine. That way you guys can get a pretty good idea on how much money does it take to start how much money do gumball machines make and basically the overall experience on starting a gumball machine business so i hope you guys enjoy the video if you guys do don't forget to drop a like subscribe if you haven't already and let's get into the video Alright you guys, so I couldn't really find a good spot to put the camera, that's why the angle is kind of weird. I have to be like bending down, that way you guys can see me. Let's open up the box, obviously I still haven't opened it as you guys can see. So I have no idea what it looks like, but anyways, let's go ahead and open it. Okay, so we got a whole bunch of like bubble wrap, I think. Okay, so I think this is, yeah, this is the actual like head of the gumball machine. As you guys can see, we got a pretty nice picture right there. Okay, so right here, I don't know if you guys can see, this is the stand to the gumball machine. Everything is actually packaged pretty good, so that's good. And then last but not least, we have an empty box. <laughs> okay, let me get that out of the way. And then we have a weird square box, which I have no idea what it is yet. Let me see if I can move the camera down here, that way you guys can get a better view. Wow, look at that. It's actually made out of metal. Can you guys hear that? You can actually knock somebody out with this. It's pretty heavy. Oh, okay, so I don't know why I didn't think of this before, but it is basically the metal plate that goes at the very bottom. Why is it so heavy? But look, that's how it looks. It's pretty nice. It comes with a little bag which has like nuts and just some extra parts that you need to set up the machine. And now for the best part, let's go ahead and open up the actual vending machine. Or I guess I should say gumbo machine. So it actually came with four keys. I was thinking it would only come with two. Guys, check this out. Look how clean this looks. It's a really nice gumball machine. It's made out of fully metal, so it's really nice. Just so you guys can get a better view, this is what it looks like. It has the nice rhino on the front. I don't even know the names of the parts for these gumball machines, so I'm sorry. And then on top, it says rhino vending. If we turn the machine around, as you guys can see over here in the back, we got a little opening, which is where you put the key. That way, whenever you go fill up the machine, you don't have to take off the whole top just to get the coins. You basically just put the key, and then this whole bottom plate just opens up, and it makes it really easy to take out all the quarters. But anyways, let's go ahead and finish building it. So for the past 30 minutes, I've been trying to screw in the head of the machine into the metal pole. But that's because I've been trying to put these little screws in through the bottom, which I'm supposed to open up the machine, take it apart, and put the screws in through the inside of the machine. So I guess let's go ahead and take the machine apart. I think this is the right key. Let's see. Okay, it's not. I guess these are the keys that go to the back of the machine to take out the coins. So let me get the other ones. Guys, it's so weird. It doesn't open. It's turning now. I got scared for a second. <laughs> take this off and this plastic globe you basically just pull it up and it comes right off ah oh, check this out guys it actually came with an extra wheel for the machine but that's pretty cool that it came with a candy wheel and that way i can put skittles m&ms basically any small candy that can fit also by the way if you guys want to know where i got this machine from like i said it's a really nice machine it's made out of metal it's one of the best machines you can get but that's not the best part guys the best part is that these machines are under a hundred dollars you guys might be like hi man so you're telling me I can get a brand new gumball machine made out of metal for under a hundred dollars that is exactly what i'm saying if you guys want to know where i got this machine from click the link down below in the description all right everyone so finally after like forever i finally got the machine done you know it's pretty much done we got everything locked in now the last thing that we need to have the machine finish is adding some gumballs 
If you guys are wondering where I got these gumballs from, I got them from Sam's. But you do have to purchase them online because I don't think Sam's has them like in the store. It was $20 for a box of 850 gumballs. And by the way, if you are a Plus member, you do get free shipping. So I got free shipping on this. Also, by the way, guys, every single time you're going to be touching candy or gumballs, make sure you wear gloves. Even if you're not going to be touching it, just so people can see that, you know, you're being clean, you're being safe, and that they can trust the candy that you're putting into the machine. Alright guys, so quick tip, if you do buy the gumballs from Sam's, then it does come with like a little label inside the box. It basically just has the different types of gumballs. The way that you put this in the machine is you fill up the machine first halfway with gumballs and then you want to go ahead and place it inside just like that. Once you have it inside like that, then you finish putting in the rest of the gumballs. All right, now let's go ahead and put the top in. As you guys can see, we got the gumballs inside. It looks really nice, but let's see. Guys, also by the way, at the end of the video, I am doing the 50,000 subscriber giveaway, which I was supposed to do like a couple weeks ago. So if you guys want a chance to enter the giveaway, make sure you watch the whole video. So now that we got the machine filled up, now it is time to test it, you know, make sure that everything works. You always want to make sure that it works. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the quarter in and let's see. I got the quarter in, now I'm gonna twist it. And, oh, you guys can't even see it. Hey, oh, fuck, I dropped it. All right, you guys, so we are finally finished. As you guys can see, the machine is done. We got the gumballs inside, it's clean, it's good to go. It is now time to find a better location for this machine. So I'm actually gonna be going to a few locations right now. I might only go to like four or five to see if I can actually find a location for it today. It'll be awesome if I can, hopefully I do. You guys cross your fingers. So now all I have to do is take a picture of the machine. That way I can show the owner. So let me see if I can get a good angle. There we go. Now let's see if we can get one of the front. Bam, we got it. All right, so I'm here at the first location that I'm gonna go ahead and give it a try. It is a Mexican restaurant, and even though I do speak Spanish, it's kind of hard to translate like the whole vending machine business into Spanish. <laughs> so, I mean, hopefully, I say everything right and I get the location. But, anyways, let me go inside and see what they say. All right, so the first location, it was a fail, and it's not because they said no, but basically, the manager or the owner was not there, so I couldn't really ask them. And that's basically the reason why you want to be talking to the owner or the manager. That way, you guys can get the final no or yes. But, anyways, let's go to the second location. If you guys can see, I I'm currently in a small plaza that has like a whole bunch of businesses like all the way around and I just finished going from door to door to every single business to see if I can put the machine there I went to every single business in this plaza except for two because one of them is a grocery store and the other one is like a big corporate restaurant so there's no point I'm going to ask if you're gonna start a vending machine business then you're gonna have to get used to people telling you no for example I didn't get a location today but I'm still gonna try tomorrow if I don't get one tomorrow I'm still gonna try the next day and then after that until eventually you know I get my location but anyways let's go ahead and go home and talk about that giveaway all right everyone so we're finally back home after trying to find a location it kind of sucks I was really hoping to get a location today but anyways now for the time that you guys have been waiting for it is the 50,000 subscriber giveaway before I get into details I want to give you guys a huge huge thank you for getting me to 50,000 I really do put a lot of work into my videos, so it really makes me happy to see people actually enjoy my videos but anyways, you guys might be wondering, Jaime, what are you going to be giving away? I will be giving away a brand new gumball machine. It's not this one, of course, obviously, but I do have an extra one right next to it. As you guys can see, it is already packaged. And just so y'all can see that there is a machine inside of here. Right here is the head to the machine. It has the keys. And this box over here has the metal plate and the metal pole to the machine. Like I said, it is the exact same machine as this one, except the other one's yellow, I think. There's only three things you guys have to do to answer this giveaway. Number one, you guys have to be subscribed. Okay, if you're not subscribed, then I'm sorry you can't win if you are subscribed already then you pretty much got step number one done step number two you guys have to like this video it takes two seconds just go down below like the video now for the third and final step that you guys have to do you guys are gonna have to guess how many gumballs are inside of this machine I'm not gonna be recording around the machine just so you guys can have a bit more of a challenge so it should be pretty fun you know like I said just let me know down below how many gumballs you think is inside and just like before you can guess as many times as you want but the first person that gets the number right you are gonna be winning the brand new gumball machine if some of you guys want to get into vending but don't have a lot of money then this is the perfect chance for you guys to win a brand new gumball machine for 
free and start your vending machine business. Also, by the way, some people have been asking me who won the money that I took out from the abandoned vending machine. And it actually took a long time until somebody guessed the number. I think it was like almost five days until somebody guessed it. I did announce the winner on a YouTube post. So if you guys want to know who won, just go check out the community post on my page. But anyway, that's going to be pretty much it for the video. I hope everyone did enjoy the video. Good luck to everyone on the giveaway. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out.